Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you one of the easiest ways I've ever come across for streaming to different platforms like YouTube, Facebook, and Twitch. And I usually cover mobile apps, so I'm gonna do this all on my phone, but there is no app to download. You could actually do it on this website that I'm gonna show you. It's called Melon, and the Melon app right on the website lets you stream to any platform you want, and it also lets you stream to multiple platforms at the same time. So I'm gonna cover all of that in this video. If you wanna do this on your desktop, on your computer, I have a completely separate video that I'll link below. And I have a link to this website in the description. So if you click on there, you could come in and sign up. So you could just press try Melon here and sign in. I'm gonna go ahead and sign in since I already have an account. And on this page, I'm gonna give it access here and I'll go through with the onboarding process. And at this point, I've given it access. So I'm gonna show you exactly how to live stream. I'm gonna use my phone right here that I have on this arm. I'll show you the whole process. And here's just a camera on my phone. And what I could do here too, I could turn my phone the other way if I wanna be set up the other way on this arm. This arm easily rotates too. So this is me, I'm hiding my video for now. And then if you could see right under that, I could also invite guests. So if I want to go live with different guests, or if I just wanna use this as a video conferencing platform like Zoom, for example, I could do that too. So all I have to do to invite a guest is I could go ahead and copy a link or email that link directly from here. And when I send that link to someone, they just have to click it and they could join me. They don't have to download anything. It's one of the easiest processes for video conferencing and for live streaming. Now, let me show you some of the options here before we go live. So you have your microphone here. You can mute and unmute that at any time. You also have this camera option here. So I could stop the camera anytime I want. I have a settings gear here where I could change my video and audio quality from here. So you have all these options. If you have any issues, you could go ahead and check those on that. And right on top too, you also have a chat box. So you could see the stream chats over here and the private chat will show up over here too. You have an edit option too, where you could do ton of things like showing a banner here. You could add a logo. You could change the design of this whole thing. There's a bunch of themes to choose from. So you could take a look at some of those and select them and it will change the whole layout. I'm gonna press apply on that. And then there is a notifications tab. So let me go back to the home page, and everything is set up here. I'm gonna press go live. And here you could basically choose where you want to go live on. I have a YouTube account here connected. You could also link Facebook, you could link LinkedIn, Twitch, Periscope, and you could even do a custom link if you're streaming to your website and you don't want to embed a YouTube video, for example. In this case, I'm gonna change it from public to unlisted here since I'm just doing this as a test. So that's all you have to do. For example, if you wanted to do the same thing as a test, set this to unlisted after you link your YouTube account. So then I'm gonna choose that YouTube platform here to stream to. But if I wanted to stream to Facebook at the same time, this is where I would link that account and make sure that's checked on too. In this case, let's just do YouTube. I'm gonna press next and go ahead and give it a title. So this is just a test stream here and give it a description and then go live. And just like that, I'm live on YouTube right now. And since I'm going on YouTube, I could rotate my phone so I'm actually in the same aspect ratio that YouTube likes, which is kind of that horizontal 16 by nine view. So I could rotate my phone that way and then select one of these options if I wanna change the layout here. And just now, if I wanna invite a guest, I could still do that, copy this link, generate a new link or email it, and they could jump in on this live stream with me just from that link. It's really, really straightforward. Now I could go to the chat too, to see if there's anything on the stream. I'm obviously on private right now, so it's not gonna show, but they will appear over here on the chat window. And if I go back here, this is what I'm gonna look like. Now, anytime I could end this, I could just go over here and I'm gonna go ahead and press end stream on the bottom. End. And it's brought me back here where I could start a new stream at any time by pressing go live. And it's really that simple to go live on your phone, onto YouTube or any other platform that lets you go live. I hope you found this video useful. I wanna thank Melon for sponsoring this video, one of the coolest app I ever reviewed on this channel. Thanks so much for watching. I post easy to follow app videos on this channel every single week and I hope to catch you next time.